Yo, what is good, y'all? Back here with another video. Hey, man, this literally might be my first Tate video now that I think about it, but Andrew Tate joined uh, the call of Dylan Dennis and Aiden to talk about Logan, and obviously we've been reacting to all the boxing uh, YouTuber stuff, the influencer boxing, y'all know I love it. We reacted to so, so, so very much of it, and it is obviously one of my favorite things and most entertaining things to watch and, you know, speak on. It's really cool. Um, and obviously Tate was kind of part of it, but obviously, you know, by the way, if y'all don't know here, considering this is my first time, you know, Tate, 100% with every, every single logic, I wish I can be as motivated and as, you know, much as him, but I'm gonna get there one day and work with it. He's obviously been a little quiet ever since, you know, he's de dealing with a lot of stuff that he shouldn't be dealing with. Um, it's very unfortunate and it's scary, but shout out Tate, man. Great for this world. Great for, hopefully he can save the world. Hopefully he can be, you know, continue to set a good example. Hopefully, you know, nothing tragic ever happens. He's a great uh, example in this world of what a man has to be like. Um, I love Tate. Great. Great guy. Um, no doubt. Um, Appreciate you, Tate. Appreciate you, man. Um, got to take over again for real. But let's go ahead and see what they speak on. And I know the Kim Jong Un Aiden had in here. Um, obviously it was fake. Um, even Tate talked talk, talk to him. I saw the clips. I do see a lot of these clips. That's how I knew that this even happened. Um, you all know that, but we reacted to all the face-offs. You know, with Atlantis, all the side beef, all everything. So now we got to see what they got to say about this. It's not not that long. You know, and you all know how I feel about Aiden. You know, he's not my favorite. And, you know, I really like early Aiden 2023 when he was bald. That's when I liked Aiden the most. But and but M when he was with the rappers, obviously, and having people on the stream, that was lit. He started that shit. There's no doubt about it. That's why you gotta give respect, bro. He started that shit. But you know, just the the stuff. Hey, Dylan, you the same cat as him? No, I, I, oh, I can't see. really hear you. How do I do this? You gotta turn your volume oh. turn your volume up on your phone. Oh no, you have to the speaker button. I think maybe. Okay, let's see what they was talking about, it, though. Can I hear you now? Yeah. Huh? Yo yo yo. Hey, sing on. Kind of hard to hear you. Maybe should I put headphones? AirPods might work, yeah. All right, hold on a second. Let me get headphones. I didn't realize I only have my phone. That's why like... do you guys have the same tattoo? Yeah, Top cheese, really? that's why. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, should, I, yours? should, I, should, I, should I get it then? You should. Do you have any tattoos? Well, it's haram, right, Andrew, to get tats? Yeah, um, I, I, is it? A lot of things are haram. Um, true. Wait, but Andrew, in in in, uh, Damn, in Andrew Islam and the, the Muslim culture, and Islam and like the religion, the is if you had tattoos, if, <laughs> and, like though, Andrew, but... if Andrew, if you had tattoos prior to conversion, right? Like it, it's 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 okay, right? Yeah, it's reversion, yes. And I'm not an Islamic scholar. I'm still learning along with everybody else. And I'm very careful about talking about the religion because I believe it's a beautiful religion. And I have a lot of respect for it, and I don't want to ever get it wrong. It. But when you revert all of your, I, I think I have a, a private, funny moment of tapes that I still never been able to post. I'll get it up. Yo, Dylan, what's good? Uh, this is not really working. What the fuck is he wearing? All right, bro. Come on, Dylan. I think I'm oh, there you go. Okay, yeah, we're good. Well, I have no shirt on. Take your shirt off. Okay. It's on, pretty much. Andrew, did you see me and him train or not? Uh, I saw you. I saw him on the ground crying. I was trying to man him up, but it's pretty tough. Be does he even try and fight back or does he just like squirm like a little girl and stuff? Nah, nah. <laughs> Shut just, up! No, nah, he just squirms like a little girl. Dude, you, you did. My... You know you did. You're out of my fucking weight class. <laughs> Actually, we might be the same weight to be honest. I think, why are you putting your shirt back on? You feeling uncomfortable? Because you make me feel insecure. I take a bathroom break. I'm going to go pee. All right, you guys go ahead and uh, catch up. Be back. The ones to fight, Dylan. October 14th. Chat, let me know if they say the Now I'm up the ass, man. It's, I don't know what to do. This bullshit. It's quarter every day. Not not what, what, it's not bullshit. That's what they do. Yeah. That's what the, this has always been the primary weapon of the Matrix. Lawfare. They just attack you with lawsuits. Mm. And they try and drain you financially and try and distract you. It's endless. Mm. I think Logan doesn't want me to show up. I think that's where I'm at right now. I think he doesn't want to fight me. I think he's just trying to get me to get to pull out somehow so then he looks like the hero, you know? I, I don't know. It's bullshit. Because this is all going through him, you know? And even if I win the case, right, I still have to pay over four hundred thousand dollars in just attorney fees, lawyer fees. So it's like just bullshit. When I'm promoting a fight, this is the biggest yeah, fight he's promoted. ever done, and or event he's ever done, and I made the whole event. Like it's just bullshit, man. You, you did make the event interesting. I'll give you that. I I have I to be. Uh, you you certainly made it interesting. Or you just got to be boxing. I have, I have to do something. Come on. I mean, we're not gonna talk about me and him boxing. We're both not boxers. Like we have to. It has to be something else. You know. <laughs> and you chose an interesting topic. I'm trying to stay neutral. 
because I'm in the middle of a judicial process. Hey, I know. I can say that, that you made it interesting. Let's put it that way. No, I mean, I'm going to I'm, I'm say, I'm, I'm gonna, I'll be honest. You did. You did, Dylan. But one thing I'll tell you, this would have never worked if it wasn't Logan, if he wasn't a scumbag. And if, if it wasn't true, mm. it was being like his all the stuff I put out about mm. the girl is real. Everything is real. And that's the only reason it works. And I never said anything about her. I never put her before. Video, I just put pictures up there and see. I just let the people decide. So that's how it went. And like this I think it would only thing work with the fake Like drama. I was talking about Dustin Poirier or something like that or someone I mean, else. I don't think it worked. I was hyped. I thought it was real, bro. I would have been hyped, bro. That would have been lit. But he gonna see that shit and get tight, bro. <laughs> same way. So that's my opinion on it. Dylan, and I'm not getting any back end, so he's making all the money off this, and now he's trying to sue me. So like, fuck him then. So. Mm. What do you think, Aiden? I'm saying, are you so if you're being sued up the ass, mm. um, are you guys still gonna fight? It's we're supposed to, yeah, but like, what's the point in this? Like, I'm getting another lawsuit, another lawsuit every single day. I have to go to the gym. I got guys waiting at the gym trying to fucking serve me papers. I can't even go to the gym. Now they dox my fucking apartment. Now I'm trying to get swatted all the time. Like it's fucked up. Welcome to the club. Around. We've all we've all been swatted. Me, Andrew, and you now. So you're not yeah, welcome to the club. It. I guess so. Yeah, it's just bullshit, bro. It's just fucking with the uh, the training. But you know, he's an easy fight, so I don't really don't mind. <laughs> I can't wait. Yeah, it's 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 lawfare. It's endless. And you make. I mean, I like to consider myself an arbitrator of truth. I like to consider myself a pretty fair guy. What you yeah. just said. It's pretty fair. You're you're presenting information without mm. comment, and you're allowing yeah. people to come to their own conclusions. And the only reason I'm getting more upset now <laughs> at her and I'm going at her is because she's suing me, and she's suing me over trying to lie, saying I smacked, I hacked her Snapchat in 2014 on an iPad. I'm like, what the hell? You? I don't even know who the hell you were in 2014. Like, I, it's all bullshit stories trying to make me look like a bad guy that hacked her stuff. Never hacked anybody's stuff. <laughs> Those pictures are all easily found online, you know? Like, I could prove that everything was online already. So, even though... Chat, Dylan right, or uh, Logan, who y'all got in the box match? I still have to pay my attorney fees and my lawyer fees. This case can go on for two, three years. So, like, it's, it's just bullshit, you know? I'd rather give that money to people or, or to the people that he scammed it in that sense. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's how lawfare works. They attack you endlessly. And, uh, I mean, Logan and I have had our disagreements in the past. That's that's yeah. certain. But, um... I thought he was an entertainer, you know? I thought he would have uh, understood the promotion side of this, you know? So, I guess not. I guess he can't handle it. He's egotistical. He can't handle when he gets the fire put back on him and he can't control the narrative. He just sues. So, just like a Chris, I, I mean, uh, yo, Dylan, later this week or next week, would you be down to do uh, what I did with Fury and KSI? Would you and Logan be down to come into Discord together on my stream? Yeah, I don't know. I mean, sure. I don't mind doing that stuff with him. It's just... He's kind of, he talks over you, he yells, he kind of does this whole WWE thing that's just like really annoying to talk to. But I mean, I don't mind. He doesn't, he, and when you, whenever you make a good point, he'll just be like, he'll, he'll go to the next thing and then he'll just like try to, you start yelling again and try to not let you prove a point. He's just really, like, you know, he doesn't know how to have a discussion. Okay. Do you think he's happy with his relationship? I think now, no. I don't think so. I think I think I think he didn't know a lot of things that uh, I know, and I know a lot of things that I don't put out there. That how many guys that she's done? Like it, it's some crazy shit that she, she's a crazy girl. Like I, I I don't know. I mean, I'm, he might be happy, but I don't know. I think he's he's gonna get divorced. He's gonna get half his money taken in a couple of years. Jesus. But that, I mean, yeah. Yeah, I'm not I'm not here to personally attack anybody, but I do think there. In my personal experience, I'll speak from my own personal experience. In my personal experience, women who have been with lots of guys, they struggle to stay dedicated to a guy. Mm. Especially the girl that has been with over celebrities-wise, probably 20, 30 celebrity men. And then regular guys, probably over 100. And maybe more that I know of that I haven't put out there. And, like, guys that I... Like, there's guys that are in the city, like, just, like, club guys that have dated her for, like, months on end, taking her to weddings. Um... In like multiple groups, you know, she grew up in New York City, so she's just like that kind of normal social like girl that dated every single club guy, stuff like that. He was actually presented, so it's a, this, the way he was presented to her is from a club guy. He's a promoter and a value innocence in women, and I think the innocence makes. And how we're gonna end it all? I think. I mean, this is nothing. Yeah, I don't really think she she was. Was. Let's be honest. Let's 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 cut the shit right. We're living in a world now. Where me saying that female innocence is respected 
is enough for me to get demonized and them to put me in jail and attack me with a full fucking attack. They'll put me through lawfare to the woman when she hasn't marriage the hardest. No, marry me, marry me, marry me, marry me. And they'll hold off on sex and pretend to be a good girl and all this garbage living out these lives and fit and blah, blah, blah. Sure. I mean, the interesting thing isn't even the fight so much now. The interesting thing is across the next five to 10 years, if they stay together or not, right? Because if, mm -hmm. they, if they make it work, then nothing matters. But if they don't make it work, yeah, exactly. That's a, a, a lot of conversation. That's what I was told too. There, there is, they, 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 I heard that too, Dylan. Dylan, someone had told me, um, they said like, Dylan won the fight if, if Logan and his wife don't make it. Like, I, I mean, it's like, I, I just, man, I, I look, Dylan, I'm gonna be honest though, bro. Like, I just want to see you two just get there. Wait, when is it? October, what is it? 14, like four weeks, four and a half. Yeah, like less than, yeah, almost four weeks now. Like you made, you made Logan. It's, it's an easy fight. It's an easy fight. We should be fighting MMA with all this talk. It should be, uh, if it was MMA, MMA if it was MMA, MMA, you would win 100%. I told you, I, for the box. He guaranteed me a rematch in MMA. But we'll see if he, you know, he's not a man of his word, but, you know, mm. fuck him. Mm. I it do think also, MMA. though, I want to say something. I know America is the most failed nation in the world, but there are a lot of women in the world, especially oh. in other places, and especially in America as well. There's a lot of women who understand exactly what we're saying and understand that their purity is an asset and it should be protected at all costs. There are a lot of women who actually very much understand. Y'all let me know your thoughts. Very, very interesting. Entertaining as always, man.